or one of those little dinky two bites. <laughs> I don't or, think you can say dinky. Or one of those. I think you gotta call it. <laughs> or little. You can't say dinky. <laughs> okay. You have to say the medical term. Hey the friends, I'm Nicole, I've lost 130 pounds, kept it off for 7 years, and in this video, I'm sharing 8 low calorie food swaps from Costco for easy weight loss. Number 1, chocolate. I am always craving chocolate, but one of the full size Hershey's chocolate bars from the club pack from Costco is anywhere from 220 to 290 calories. So instead, I like to choose, there is Brookside dark chocolate. There are, they come in three different flavors in little pouches. One pouch is 80 calories and their fruit covered in dark chocolate. So you get your chocolate fix for less calories than the chocolate bar. However, if you want something more chocolate bar-y, then I like to choose the fun size chocolate bars. It's like the Mars variety pack. And you can have three to four of the minis for anywhere from 180 to 200 calories, depending on the ones you choose. Or you can have one mini, I googled it, for 60 to 70 calories if you want to save even more. So you're still getting your chocolate bar fix for less calories. And the reason why I'm making this video is because I get asked quite often how I dealt with my cravings on my weight loss journey. And what I found is any time that I denied my cravings, it backfired, I would go way off track and I'd end up emotional eating because I struggled with that and I'd end up gaining weight. So instead, when I have a craving and when I had one on my weight loss journey, I liked to give myself a low calorie version of what I was craving most of the time. Every once in a while, I'll give myself the full version, the regular one, but if I want to meet my goals, I choose the low calorie version so I still satisfy my craving, but I stay eating in a calorie deficit, that way I can lose weight or stay lean, whatever my goal is. So number two, pizza. I'm always craving pizza, I love it, however, the Kirkland frozen pepperoni pizza, a third of the pizza is 470 calories. Or you can have, and this is amazing, Sassy and I just ate this for dinner yesterday, half of the Molinero's cauliflower pizza kit that you can find in the bakery section at Costco, you can have half of one of the pizzas that you get, the cauliflower pizza, you use half the package of sauce, one of the Grimm's Lean Turkey Pepperonis, and then you can put a black diamond marble cheese string from the refrigerator section, and for that whole thing, for half the pizza with the pepperoni and the diamond cheese string, 400 calories. So you get half the pizza for less calories, whereas it's only a third of the pizza for the pepperoni one. And we're, let me tell you guys something. We're pretty picky when it comes to pizza and it that cauliflower crust does not feel like you're sacrificing taste for the calories. When I ate, when I bit into it for the first time, I was like, is this seriously cauliflower? Like, and I'm pretty honest with food and I was like, whoa, I can't even taste that it's cauliflower. It's really good it, it's almost it's like an eight out of ten if you're looking for the real thing number three cookies i'm always loving cookies i love the kirkland cookies however the kirkland chocolate chunk cookies from the bakery 210 to 220 calories it didn't say on the package so i googled it and it's 210 to 220. if you ever tell me to google something you know what my answer will be no <laughs> 210, 220 calories for one of those cookies. Or, I have three options here for you. A package of the Kirkland Thin and Crispy Chocolate Chip Mini Cookies, they're the mini ones, one package, 140 calories. So you still get the chocolate chip cookie craving out with way less calories. Or, they have made good soft baked mini cookies, red velvet flavor. I actually wanna try these. 120 calories for one package, or they have 
It's called Noni's Pumpkin Spice Biscotti Bites. You can have three for 120 calories which is amazing. And the friends, if you are liking these swaps and you wanna know exactly what I ate to lose the weight, I have weight loss eBooks. The links are all down below, along with the link for Hoodalt HTLT Sups. If you purchase from here, use code Nicole to save yourself 10%. Number four, <laughs> ice cream bars. Sass and I love ice cream, but it can be pretty calorie dense. One of the, and for ice cream bars, one haagen -Dazs vanilla almond bar is 280 calories. One of those little ice cream bars. Or you can have one of these, Traditions Organic Fudge Bar for 90 calories. Sassy and I ate these for dessert yesterday. And I wanna tell you, they're the bee's knees. You let them sit out for like five seconds, five to 10 seconds to thaw a bit. They are so fudgy, they taste like a really good fudgesicle, and they are a very good replacement for ice cream bars. Hey, I got a slogan for that company if they're looking to hire me. Oh no. These bars taste like the bee's knees without tasting like actual bee's knees. <laughs> Pretty good, eh? I can't even open my eyes. It was so bad. Why is his name Sassy, do you ask? The bee, all the bee's knees without the bee's knee flavor. Can I move on with the video now? All right. All right, number five, fries. Okay, french fries are my ultimate favorite thing, but I still give myself fries. It's just I learn to choose wisely with the fries because I can get more if I choose them wisely. So for example, the Cavendish Flavor Crisp Classic Frozen Fries in the freezer section at Costco, you get 16 fries for 140 calories. Right next to them are the Cavendish restaurant style drive through french fries. And you can have 43 of them for 160 calories. And I kind of calculated on my fitness pal, like if you ate 43 of the classic fries, it would be like over 350 calories. So you're getting a good amount of fries for way less calories. And you know what? Those fries are delicious. They taste like McDonald's. Yes, but they do. I got a slogan if Cavendish is looking to hire me. You ready for this one? Uh, Cavendish drive through style french fries. These are not McDonald's. Because that's what they taste like, but they're legally not allowed to say they're McDonald's french fries. So, so, so the, they whisper, not McDonald's. I know, I okay. actually really love that it says drive through fries on it. But anyway, what I found is the thinner cut fries, often you can eat more of them for less calories. So that was the point aside from what sassy boy said. <laughs> not McDonald's. Number six. Can we do this, Seth? <laughs> I don't know, can we? <laughs> Number six. He does this off camera all day, by the way. Number six, chips. The Lay's Classic Chips, you can have 36 for 280 calories, or you can get the Frito-Lay variety pack that they have at Costco. It's like a ton of different mini bags. One of those mini bags is 150 to 160 calories, depending on which bag that you choose, and then you can choose whatever one you want. Every day you can choose a different one. And what I love about the mini bags is, that's how Sassy and I did portion control in the beginning. We didn't want to stop eating chips, so instead of buying a big bag and eating the whole thing, we did the mini bags. Labeled them with our names so that when that bag was done, we didn't eat anymore. And uh, that really helped us a lot. Number seven, brownies. And I was shocked at this one. I love brownies, but like, okay, you know in the bakery section at Costco where they have the two bite brownies and you're looking at them, you're like, oh, they can't be that many calories. Like they're two bite brownies, right? Even though I can do it in one bite, but I, I, I don't want, I don't like to brag about things. I can probably do it in one bite too. Not bragging or anything, but okay. Come on guys. <laughs> one of those two bite brownies, like you're not even going to believe this. 120 <laughs> calories for, for one? one of those, this, this size, one of these brownies or you can have, I found these really cool things. Um, they're called Good To Go. They come in a big box and you get two types, blondies and brownies. So you can choose. And one package is 80 calories. So you can have a whole package of mini brownies or blondies for 80 
or one of those little dinky two bites. <laughs> I don't or, think you can say dinky. Or one of those. I think you gotta call it. <laughs> or. <laughs> or a little. <laughs> you can't say dinky. <laughs> okay. You have to say the medical term. <laughs> so you can have a whole package of mini blondies or brownies for 80 calories versus one of those tiny little two bite brownies for 120 calories. Number eight, burgers. Crazy, the Roadhouse Angus beef burgers that you find in the frozen aisle, one of them, 410 calories. Or, Kyle and I, Sassy and I, will get the Kirkland lean ground beef and we make our own patties. So what I like to do is I measure out five ounces of uncooked lean ground beef and then when it cooks, it's usually around four ounces. And four ounces of lean beef is about 180 calories. So by making your own patty, you're saving yourself a ton of calories. Or if you're cool with um, any type of burger, like a vegetarian burger, the Beyond Burgers in the freezer section are 240 calories. And a cool story is when Sassy and I were at the beginning of our weight loss journey, because he's lost the same amount of weight that I have, we went to Harvey's, which is a burger chain here in Canada where we live, and we used to eat fast food there all the time. We didn't want to stop eating Harvey's, so instead of eating the burgers, we would get the, like the beef burgers, we would get the veggie burger when we were losing weight. And, um, Someone, an employee there actually realized and said, hey, by making just that one switch, like you guys are losing a lot of weight. And so that's what we did. We still ate burgers. We just ate the lower calorie one, which was the veggie burger at the time. So that's a great option if you're looking for a burger and you don't mind vegetarian ones. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I really, Sassy and I really believe in giving ourselves whatever we're craving, even if it's the low calorie version, because we find it really helps keep us motivated and on track. So hopefully those things help you guys. Thanks for watching. We love you so much. Don't forget to subscribe and watch more vids for cool, fun tips and sassiness Whoa. from the man behind the camera. Love ya. Look at those biceps. <sighs> I'm a pterodactyl. <laughs> <laughs> love you guys. On that note, see ya. <laughs> Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up. <laughs>